Hi there. So let's close model one. Okay. So the first thing is that we have covered a lot. Okay. We the a lot of tutorials. We cover different solvers, a lot of files, how to modify science. Okay. And this is particular particularly important if you are new to open for now get familiar with the file with all the input files so if you make it this far so just congratulate yourself because we cover a lot okay a lot about open phone and general concept of cfd tutorial but starting from next models we are not going to details in, in as we did in this in, in these models of, of each input input file okay unless we introduce something new we are going to assume that you are already familiar so after you have finished this model okay <clears throat> you should be able to understand the following okay uh, open phone directory structures explore the source code or documentation the phone info command okay find information in the source code and slot seeing uh documentation uh the basic case directory structure okay so remember you always have the same case directory you only need to modify the input files and should choose the the right solver run simple cases in serial but also in parallel and in next models we're talking about we're going to talk about more parallel running in parallel uh, modify existing cases understand the error output okay so don't don't enter into panic if you get an error just read the script the the screen because most of the time you you open phone is going to point out where you have the error okay uh we use incompressible solvers okay you know in open phone and remember regarding these incompressible solvers the pressure that you have is pressure divided density so be, be careful also you you can use relative pressure instead when you move to compressible solver or any other solver uh you need to define actual pressure and also you use the actual pressure, no? You report it in Pascal. Uh, we get some basic knowledge about the utility, the machine utility, block mesh, but later also we're going to cover more in details this block mesh. But more important, we're also to, going to cover a snappy X mesh, okay? Converting meshes to open form. We saw that in the last tutorial cylinder case where we use a specific utility to convert it from fluent format. Okay, and remember when you convert the mesh and also when you create the mesh, always open this file, the boundary file, and just check the type and the name of the patches. Also, we address some mapping, initialization, and post processing. Okay, and with some basic scientific visualization and post processing that we're going to cover in more details in the next model. Okay, so here we saw the, ba the basic, and then later we're going to, to dissect each of these models. Okay, or the <coughs> of these models and <clears throat> these uh, utilities that we have used so far and important get familiar with the linux command so that's all for this model okay i hope you enjoy it and see you in the next more advanced models bye